the doors of the Melbourne Fat Duck are officially open. More than 250,000 people entered a ballot for just 14,000 seats. For the successful applicants, the wait is finally over. Very excited. Heston has just one chance to win over the Australian public with his groundbreaking dishes. His success lies in their hands. Welcome to the Fat Duck. Hello, welcome, how are you? The Fat Duck is not a restaurant. Not in conventional sense of the word. It's the whole experience from the moment you make the booking to after you leave the restaurant. The journey begins with a nitro poached aperitif, an alcoholic meringue of vodka, gin or Campari that's poached in liquid nitrogen and designed to turn on the taste buds. There's a reason why the nitro cocktails at the beginning, they're mouth-watering. They've got acidity, which makes your juices, really gets your juices flowing. It's like wetting the appetite. <laughs> Like a dragon. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that was so good. <laughs> Six lollies, one no fish. Once the palate is primed, the menu moves on to evoke powerful memories of childhood nostalgia with Heston's savoury lollies. Oh, there you go. Thank you. How amazing. Do you reckon we can eat the grass? <laughs> <laughs> These lollies are inspired by Heston's childhood trips to the seaside and his ice cream van favourites. The Rocket, the Twister and the Feast. Traditionally sweet, these lollies are anything but and they combine the flavours of classic canapes. The Rocket is layers of apple, celery and walnut. The Twister is a cylinder of tea-smoked salmon wrapped in avocado mousse. The Feast, or for Australia, the Golden Gay Time, is chicken liver pâté dipped in fig and red wine compote and cocoa nibs. 